San Francisco's Grace Cathedral working on a big update to the New Testament. The stained glass window depicting the holy book, that is. KPX 5's Don Ford on the painstaking process of repairing the priceless artwork. It's nearly four stories tall, almost 90 years old. One of the cathedral's largest stained glass windows is in serious trouble. We need to take the panels out now before we have catastrophic failure. This priceless work of art has been beating back the weather since 1931. The old lead channels are falling apart, holes are letting water in, and repairs made decades ago were done poorly. And they cut it here through that line in order to fit the panel in the groove, and then they tied it with those wire. This one window alone has 303 panels holding more than 5,000 pieces of glass. Before anything is touched, every single piece is carefully studied, measured, and recorded. And it takes a special team, says canon sacrist Greg Sodron. So bringing Ariana in because I, her credentials are so stunning that she's really closer to a museum curator than she is to a, a glass fixer person. With a crew of five, every panel will be repaired and restored in Oakland at a special facility. Sometimes there are hidden messages left inside the lead lining, dates or a personal greeting from artists hundreds of years ago. But sometimes, and this is sort of the holy grail, you'll actually get the signature of the artist who painted that piece. Grace Cathedral won't say how much this massive restoration conservation project will cost because that's being covered by a private donor who wishes to remain anonymous. The church says it'll be months before the job here is done, but they say they'll have it completed in time for Easter 2016. In San Francisco, Don Ford, KPX 5. Wow.